The Lynx is a German armored fighting vehicle developed by Rheinmetall Landsys team. The Lynx KF-41 infantry fighting vehicle was unveiled at the Eurosatry Defense Exhibition on 12 June 2018. According to Rheinmetall, the Lynx family of tracked armored vehicles is at the forefront of a new trend in IFV design toward armored vehicles with lower unit and through life costs and reduced complexity. One of the key principles of the Lynx concept is the integration of proven subsystems with a high technology readiness level to reduce development time, cost and technical risk. The Lynx is built around a sponson-shaped hull with a long, shallow glacis and angled belly plate. The driver compartment is at the front left, the engine the front right, fighting compartment in the middle and there is a dismount compartment at the rear, access to which is via a ramp in the rear of the vehicle. A key feature of the Lynx design concept is the separation and modularity of the vehicle into two primary parts, the basic vehicle and specialist mission and role equipment. Lynx variants are designed around a common drive module upon which the mission kits are installed. Available kits include an IFV and APC. For the former, a turret is fitted to the roof of the hull, for the latter the turret is removed and replaced by a roof plate that includes an array of vision devices and a remote weapon station. It is understood that this transformation can be carried out near to, or in the field, within eight hours. Other variants have been developed, or will be developed. Those developed and shown include a combat support vehicle and a 120mm armed fire support vehicle. Variants to be developed include a mortar carrier with 120mm mortar, an ambulance, AC-2, C-3 vehicle, and an air defense variant. The Lynx's overall design layout is conventional. The front right located power pack consisting of a Lieber D9612 diesel engine coupled to either an Allison X300 Series 6F01R or Rank HSWL256 automatic transmission. The Lieber diesel is of the common rail type and fitted with a two-stage turbocharger and two-stage intercooler. Power output when fitted to the Lynx is 1140 horsepower, although the actual engine is rated at up to 1475 horsepower. The KF-41 transmission is the same as that used in the Puma and Arjux vehicles, the Lieber engine is widely used in the construction industry, and the driver's station is taken from the Kodiak armored engineering vehicle. Mobility parameters will vary by variant and exact configuration, but are stated to include a maximum road speed of 70 km per hour, a gradeability of at least 60%, a side slope traverse capability of at least 30%, the ability to climb a 1M vertical obstacle, the ability to cross a 2.5M trench, and an unprepared fording depth of 1.5M. Operational range on 900 litres of diesel fuel is 500 km. The driver is located to the left front side of the hull and is furnished with three periscopes, one of which can be replaced with a night vision alternative. The rear crew compartment is designed as a mission neutral space with the incorporation of sea rails, and a pattern of universal fixing points on the walls and floor. This provides a flexible configuration for all mission specific equipment. A large power operated rear ramp allows for rapid ingress egress of dismounts. In addition a 5-ton capacity crane has been installed in the center of the vehicle for cargo manipulation. The remaining internal volume below the load bed is understood to house additional fuel tanks and storage for specialist equipment. The protection of the Lynx is designed to be scaled according to the threat. The vehicle's ballistic steel armor is designed to protect the Lynx from anti-tank weapons, medium-caliber ammunition, artillery shrapnel and bomblets, although exact details are classified. The interior is fitted with a spall liner to protect the crew, while the vehicle also features decoupled seats in addition to mine and IED protection packages that include a double floor. The standard armor configuration is designated the Mounted Combat Operations Kit, and it is intended to offer vehicle protection against similarly armed opponents. It is understood to combine an advanced passive component with active protection systems. The second kit is designated the Complex Urban Environment Kit and excludes any active protection elements. Lynx is understood to be available with one further armor kit that can be used for air transportation, providing a vehicle that can deploy straight from a transport aircraft. Additional active protection can be provided for shaped charge warhead attack using Rinmetal's active protection system AMAPADS. A range of passive protection and defensive aids are also available. They include a rapid obscuration system, laser warning system and acoustic shot locator system. 
These are integrated in the Lance turret when it is fitted along with automatic target recognition and automatic target tracking. The heating, cooling and nuclear, biological and chemical filtration system is combined in an environmental control system stowed in the rear-located left sponson in front of the cooling system. Air ducts lead to the floor and to an air duct interface on the top end of the hull. The IFV variant of the KF-41 variant shown at Eurosatry 2018, was fitted with the updated Lance 2.0 turret, this having flexible mission pods fitted on the left and right side so that a variety of subsystems can be installed to provide the turret with specialist capabilities. If you enjoyed this video give us a thumbs up, comment and of course subscribe to our channel and enable notifications not to miss new interesting videos so more people can see it and enjoy it too. Thanks.